Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly make a dramatic design impact on your entire website with just a few small changes. I'll show you how to change the font presets on your website built with the website.com site builder and also how to create your own custom font combination. So I'm logged into my member dashboard. I'll click to access the website builder and I've started with this template. The first thing I'm going to do is change the fonts on my entire website. Once you choose a font preset for your website, it will apply across the entire site to keep it consistent on all of your web sections and pages. So we're going to click Site Design and then click Site Fonts. You can change the fonts across your entire website by choosing a different font pack. The font pack is a font combination that will remain consistent across your website, and they've been chosen by a professional designer with the intention to make the most impact while looking cohesive on your website. Remember to keep your brand in mind as you pick a font combination. Different fonts can evoke feelings of strength, peacefulness, or playfulness. For example, this Fredoka One preset is a playful combination that's perfect for a daycare or a children's clothing store. So you see that once I've chosen a font pack, it has applied to the design across my entire website. Josephine is a font that gives a feeling of sophistication, and I'm going to choose this one. Now, if you want to create your own custom font combination, just click Customize Fonts on the font pack that you've selected. So now you can see you can choose to change the font that will be used for the section titles and the paragraph. Just click on the font and it will open up this window. Then click save. You can also customize the font weight for each font. So right now it's bold 700. You can make it thin, so it's 100. But I'll just change it back to bold. Now I'll choose a different font for the paragraph. And again, you can choose a different font weight, but I'll leave it at regular. And again, keep in mind that this combination you've created is going to be applied across your entire web design. So once all of that has been selected, you'll see it's instantly applied. If we go back, again, you could choose another preset. Keep in mind that if you choose another font pack, once you navigate away, you will lose the custom fonts that you previously created. So for example, let's say I chose this preset and navigate away. If I go back to site fonts, now the featured font is the new one that you've chosen. When you're ready to make the changes go live, click publish at the top right. We hope this was helpful and don't forget to subscribe to website.com for more tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching.